Right, here we are with our plastic containers and our storage containers for food prep. Now let's start first with our large containers here. Here I like to have this container so I can store my turkey balls. The idea of having this container is that it's long and short, allowing me to have multiple of these containers separate for when I exactly need it in the freezer. So here, boom, I can have three or four and it takes more efficient space in the freezer as well. Now the good thing about having these and why the reason I have these is because I, as here I have lunch for two days. So approximately two and a half meals here that all I do is I take out, take two of these balls, 20 grams a piece, shut it, add vegetables, add any carbs or add nothing at all, and to go. Now, this is a great thing about having these two sizes here because it makes it more efficient and effective for when you need to just take out out of the fridge, put it in your refrigerator, and just have two days. And then you don't have to open a big container and take out a bunch of frozen meats and then have to defrost the other ones so you can take a few of them out and just have them for the next two days. Here you have them portioned and rationed for every single two days. You also want to pick a small container that has a very, very secure top, not letting the liquid out, because I don't know about you, but when I have it in my lunchbox or in my backpack, this thing will shake, because I'm a very active man, so that's how it goes. These are plastic containers, they're BPA free and microwave safe. They're pricey, but as we said before, they're quality products, give you good quality uh, preparedness and efficiency.